I like this route. <laughs> this is one of this is possibly going to be one of my favourite lines. Right. Oh no, I am finished. I've got to do this bit now. Oh, good lord. Um, this is more problematic. So we're going to have to come this side of this oil well, and then come. Oh, good lord. Come down here, and and then share this bit of halo track. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. So, uh, do it with the track sky, it's a lot easier. Right, bring you out. So you're gonna come out. And let's raise you up. Oh, that's too much. That's too much, that's not enough. So we wanna kind of blend onto here, don't we? I would think. Okay, well let's do it, let's do it from this end then. So let's see, uh, which way is which? The trains are gonna be going up that side. Let's have a look, make sure. Yeah, trains going up that side. Oh, now see, this is where you could really do with a flying junction. Um, all right, all right, let's try and do it. Let's try and do a flying junction. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Now, uh, let's bring up my signals, because I need to be able to see my signals. Got signals there, we got signals there. Um, what I'm gonna do is just make sure, get out of that, I'm gonna make sure that these are one way, so that our trains don't get flipped around when I'm playing around with these lines. And let's make you one way. And this one on this end, one way. Okay, that should that should ensure that our tracks don't get screwed, uh, our trains don't get screwed around with. So we're gonna come there. Come off there. Okay. So shush. What we want is to take out a section of this outer track. I oh, did. I just I just took out that blooming signal that I just changed. Oh man. Well, hopefully, hopefully, yeah, are those, are those, yeah, are those one way? I don't know, I don't know. Well, well, I'll deal with it afterwards. I'll deal with it afterwards. So, this, this track is coming this way. So, when this, when the trains come out of this station, they, they want to come onto this track. Like that. I actually want to. How's, how's that level wise? That's fine level wise. Let's put that in. Let's put that in. So. That's going to come. The train's going to come out and come onto this track. Right? What we don't want is for trains going this way to have to wait uh, for a train coming across. So. Typically with a flying junction, this would actually bridge over this, but I think we're gonna do it the other way. So this is gonna to have to come back a bit because, because of the terrain issues. So we bring you back like that, then. Um, I'm gonna put a few bits of track in here so that I've got a, a flat bit to Although actually that doesn't make any difference because yeah, I've got a bridge over. Okay, yeah. Oh man, oh, the things that go through my mind, like especially the irrelevant stuff that goes through my mind, just staggering. Um, so we want to bring this up. That's that's coming up too much too fast. Okay, I think we're gonna to have to do this a slightly different way. Um, and I think that's gonna to have to go back even further. What I want is a straight bit of track that we can kind of link to. So let's, um, let's have a flat bit of track over here, or a flat bit of ground that we can work with. That'll do. Yeah, that's 
if I can make this work, this is going to be worth the effort. It's a question of if I can make this work. So we, what we want is a straight bit of track to link up to. Like that kind of thing. So There we go. So now we're going straight. Okay, so... Ooh, ooh. Ooh, that's doing nice things. Now, how's, it, how's that height-wise? Needs to come up one, doesn't it? Yeah, that clears the catenaries. All right, cool. So... We'll do that, turn it into the proper bridge type, and take it. Okay, now the tricky bit. We've somehow got to get this track to come underneath through these. That's going to be, that's going to be a steepish curve to get it to come between those. Man. Okay, so I, we were bringing it there. Is there any freaking way that this will come between these pillars? God, that's got to be so sharp, the bend. It's... I mean, oh. That keeps us reasonable. What about if we did, oh, come on, did something like that, still doing 100 miles an hour, still doing 80, it's not horrendous, uh, I, I think we want to lift that up a little bit though, like that. Yeah, that heads us in the right direction. Okay, let's take it. Let's see. Let's, let's just hook this up and see what it looks like. So, that would hook up into there, wouldn't it? Okay, so, trains coming out of the station come along here, underneath this track, and hook up onto this line. Okay, nice. The trains coming up this way on the halo. Uh, bum, 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 bum. Would have to come up, come off here. So. Now, I'll do that a bit sooner. How about back? Yeah, you could still do 90 coming off there, so that's probably okay. Maybe Ooh, can't do that. Yeah, what's the what's the fastest we can get? 94. 94 is fine. Our goods trains don't do more than that. So then, yeah, oh, you're not going to do it, are you? Irritating. get as close as we can so like that and then and then what we want to do is get it onto the side of this but that's probably easier said than done let's try Right there. Oh, that oh 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 that might work. Oh, hooray, hooray! Now, oh, it, I was going to say I'd like this one going into the station and then connect that one. Well, yeah, I'm going to do. It. I'm going to do. It. Let's take this back. 
bring these trains into that station. You can come up a bit further, say about there, and then be hooked onto it here. Oh. That is fine. Boom. Oh my god! Took a bit of doing, but we got it. And that just needs to be hooked up to there. I would kind of like it if this wasn't going out quite so much. So let's see what we can do. Let's tidy this up a little bit. So now that we're connected, we kind of know where we're going and what we're doing. So, so we want this to come out here. Basically, basically pretty straight following this. Like that kind of thing. Yeah, that's way better. Way better. Yeah, and then you can just go up there, hook onto there. It's still, still bending out a little bit more than I would like. Let's take you back. See if we, see if we can get it from there. Will you? Will you? Will you? Yes, you will. Hooray. Victory is ours. Victory is ours. Right, now, this is... um. <laughs> That's certainly not like a traditional flying junction, but you know what? It, it'll do. It'll do. <laughs> I will live with it. It kind of makes it interesting though, doesn't it? Right, we need to finish that off. A little bit of terrain smoothing, because it's kind of a bit all over the place at the moment. Now we... let's, let's bring it down one. Let's see if it will smooth out a little bit better. Here we go. Oh, you know what? If I turn it up to high, it'll do it a hell of a lot faster. Here we go. That's what we want. I don't. I don't want it absolutely flat at this point because because we kind of do want some slightly raised track. And what I'll probably end up doing at some point is going around doing stuff like this. Just smoothing these edges off right by the tracks. That that is the kind of stupid stuff that I go around and do. So that all of these edges look nice and smooth. But yeah, that's something to do offline. Let's crank you up to about that size. So let's smooth this off at least a bit. Again, I will play around with this terrain offline. There's no question. Bring you up like that kind of thing. Up here we want it a bit flatter. Let's bring you up. Alright, cool. So let's smooth you out, smooth you out there. How's that look? Oh, nicely complicated. All right. Bring that up a bit. Because it's a bit it's a bit too brutal. That slope. There we go. How about that? Bring this up some more. You got to love it. You got to love it. Tiny bit more along there. We're gonna have a ride on this because this is gonna be some freaking journey. Okay, so they come along. So we, um, we're at the point where we need to do signals now. Let's just bit of smooth enough on here. Wow, it's gonna be a hell of a journey. Loving it. Right, signals. I guess we do need a bit of signaling going on. So, uh, what do I want? Oh, I never showed you these cranes, did I? Oh, the, these are cranes that I got to go in here. Um, 
stop lagging. Stop lagging, damn you. And basically, yeah, they're, they're, they're a trackside asset, so they snap to the track. And you can put them in like that. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Love those. Love those. Anyway, shut up, Sky. Get on with what you're doing. So, <laughs> where were we? We're over here, aren't we? Yes, we are. So, trains coming up this side can just split off there and split off there. Don't need any signaling. Good, thanks very much. The trains coming on from this side um, need a signal there to, and a signal there. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And signal there. Um, to tell them which, which one has got right away onto this track. And then we need to do the same thing uh, with this one. So we've got the trains coming up this way. Oh, no, that's it. That's it. Because these just, these just break out. It's when they're filtering back on. Oh, my Lord. It, that's it. That's it. Right. Okay. Just Now just the regular signals. So we want a signal up uh, about... Yeah, let's put a signal there. Cure. And then we want um, just signals every so often, really. Let's have uh, a couple in there. And then they're onto the halo. So, kind of no signal in required. I do need to put a signal there. Now, let's have a look. Let's have a look at the lines and see if... Oh, yeah, it's all working. It's all working. It's all working. Hooray. <laughs> it's all working. Uh, so, then we're on to the halo, and we've got the halo signals. Cool. Um, it's a shame that our cargo trains can't kind of bypass the station because if you've got a passenger train in here they're gonna to have to wait a bit but you know what it's fine it's a freaking transport network they don't run non-stop all the time um, the thing is we've done that bit but we've got to do a similar thing around here and how the hell we're gonna do that I have no freaking idea um, I may not bother I'm certainly not going to bother right like right now. So let's see. Where have we got any signals in there? No, we don't. So we don't have to worry about any signals like right now. So the trains are coming. Oh god, I confused myself. The the trains are coming up that side. So that's staying above 100 miles an hour. So that's fine. And oh, where's the there's the little thing. Let's come off there. Like that. So here, the trains, I'm going to put the signals in, but the trains are going to have to wait for each other because they're crossing the tracks. It's, it's just the way it is. Because if I don't do that, we'll be here for freaking ever. <laughs> and I don't think you want that. Uh, let's try and stay over 100 miles an hour if we can with the track. Boom. Now, so we've got to come up here, past this oil well, and then into here. So let's get rid of that road. And so one uh, one route is going to use one platform, and one route will use another platform. So, okay, let's take this off. Oh, can, I, can I take that off? I was looking to see if I could take it straight. And I can't quite. Let's run a straight section off. The reason I'm running a straight section is because it makes putting the crosses in uh, that much easier. So let's put a let's put an X on there. Let's see, we can find the right spot. Come on, going, 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 going. Damn you! Where's the up there. Oh. And I said I'd do it. <laughs> I said I'd do it straight. I think I've done it, made it a bit long, actually. Let's do that again. Let's 
try that again. So, what speed have we got there? 123, that's fine. Boom. And let's see, let's see if we can get it to work this time. Oh, eh, oh we, got, we may have too much slope going on. Oh, come on. Seriously? Oh, man. Okay. God, I hate these X's. They're a nightmare. Let's, let's try it again. And let's see, what's the speed there? 113. Okay, so that's a bit shorter. Let's try a shorter one, see if we can get it to work. And... Oh, come on. Too much slope, really? This, th this is the kind of stuff that drives you absolutely wild. Um, you know what? Like, I, I may come back to this and revisit it, but for now, the, you know, the trains are going to go, you know what, I'm just going to do it like that. Cha-ching. You know what? N now that I've done that, I'm actually going to try and see if I, if I try not to put an X in, then it'll let me put an X in. Isn't that sod's law? Isn't that sod's law? Try not to do it and it'll do it. All right, we're gonna have to, we can't quite come straight, I don't think, because of that road. Okay, so we'll, we'll bend it round just a touch. Come around the oil well. Now, the thing here is gonna be the, the height change. That's gonna be our challenge. So, I'm actually gonna bring you down. Ooh, that's, that's probably a bit more down than I wanted to come, but. So if we bring it down, I don't know, something, something like that. Oh, <laughs> okay, those are my two options. Okay, we're gonna have to do that again. Because I want this to I want this to come down at a decent kind of gradient. The the problem is if it's if it's going too steep at this end, then it'll kind of dig down into the terrain when we try and bring it around the other way. Okay. So from here. Oh, I need to close this in order to get it to reset. So if we bring you up. So kind of here. Then have you curve around something like this. All right, that might work. And then from there. Now, how does that work? Oh, that's not, that's not bad. That's not bad. Let's bring it up one. So it's not cutting in so much. I might even bring it in one, one bring it one more. Yeah, that's hardly cutting in at all. Oh, you know what? Take that. That will do. Pig. Alrighty. This is it. This is the last section of double track, I think. So, will you hook up in one go? No, of course you won't. All right, will you hook up to, yeah, you'll hook up to there. And you hook up to there. Bingo. All righty, we've got both, we've got both lines done. Oh my Lord. Okay, super. I'm super, thanks for asking. Uh, okay, so we want to put a couple of lines in now. Yeah, let's get a uh, new line, new line. Get rid of you. Then we're gonna have green and, yeah, let's have a dark green. Yeah, what the hell. So, uh, we'll have the dark green for the livestock and this will be the food line going in. Right, so you are gonna go from this station to, God, this is gonna be fun to see how this works, to this station, Rogi Freight Station 1. And does it work? 
Yep. Yep. The answer is, it does work. So, the trains are going to come out. They're going to go along here, and then they're going to cut onto the halo. Ride along the halo for a while. Have all kinds of accidents with the passenger trains. Slow everything down. And then we're going to come around here. Now, I haven't done the signalling here, have I? No. Okay, I need to do the signalling. Yeah, all right, let's do the signalling. So, um, trains that are coming this way need a signal in here. And, yeah, we'll... Oops, that's... Ah, that's wrong. That's wrong. Um, yeah, that's going... That needs a signal for that. This needs a signal... Oh, God, if I can get one in. Come on. Oh, come on. Uh, this needs a signal... Oh, God, I can't get it to go on the truck. Come on. Why won't you go on the... Won't go on there. Oh, hang on. Where's the where's the little marker? Oh, it's there. We have one just before the just before the marker. There. There we go. All right. So you'll wait there to cross that line. Uh, you need a signal there to tell you whether it's safe to pull onto this line. And yeah. So. Line going this way has got signals. Line coming this way has got signals. Line coming uh, this way has got signals. And that's okay. Because it doesn't cross anything. Alrighty, good. So that's our signaling done. There, at least. My lord. Uh, I, we've got signals there. We, um, we've got signals there. I'm just looking to see if we need to put any extra signals in. Um, you know what, I'm going to put in a couple of... Oh, come on. Can we, what the hell is wrong with you? Oh, because it's on that switch. So I'd need to put it in before the switch, which is there. Okay, that'll do. Um, how, like, how close to the station is that? Yeah, I probably, I probably didn't really need that. Yeah, screw it, screw it, it's fine. It's fine, it'll survive. Okay, it's um, it's a fair old run. It's a fair old run. We need a signal before the X, so there. And then we just need some signals along the track. So that's about halfway. So let's whack a signal in. Oh, come on. The signals have been very awkward today um, then we'll div divide it in half again one there one there and divide it in half on this side so there and there okay that's that line done then we need to whiz over to the other line and you're going to run from look at these hollow sidings I love the name of that station to the farm which is Ice Cream Town South. All right, and yep, we need a bit of signaling on here. So, yeah, just before the switch here. Oh, now, why hasn't that switched onto the other line? Because it should have. Hmm, strange. Hopefully, I hope I haven't done anything like stupidly wrong. But where, where the hell's this? Where the hell's the station? Oh, here it is. Got a long way. It's quite a long way. Uh, but, 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 oh, because I haven't put an X on this side. Ooh, it's going to be quite a short X because it's going to have to go from like uh, there to there. Ooh, that's a very short X. Will, will you put an X in? I oh, now I didn't think it was going to. No, but you know what? It doesn't matter. So if you're going into there and that's going into that platform, then that's fine. We're fine. We're fine. So all we need to do 
that goes into there. We just need a signal just before that switch there. Cha Ching. Alrighty. And then we just need some signals along this bit of track. God, it's quite a long way though. That is quite a long way. Now, are there any signals on here already? Oh yeah, there are signals on here already. Well, that's going to save us some time. So, okay, let's put signal in there. And, oh my God, yeah, it is a long way. Let's put signal in here. There's going to be a lot of trains running on this line, I think. This is going to be... I'm thinking... I'm thinking this, this could be a six train line. There's up there and there. And then we've got signals on that stretch. We need to put signals there and there and then there and there okay and then how far to the station god yeah, it's a long way that's the switch there so halfway would be about on this bridge there and then here and here and finally one in about somewhere around here Cha ching oh my god that's all the signaling done hooray so next uh next we just need to get some trains on here p, -p, -p peachy all right how are we going to do that i think we're going to do it like the easy way so let's just get let's just get an old-fashioned, ordinary, everyday depot. Um, bum, bum, bum. What do I want? Why am I why am I looking at that, idiot? Depots, depots, railway depots. Yeah, we'll just put an ordinary, everyday depot in here. Yeah, like that. Hook up our track. Nothing fancy. Nothing fancy at all. In you go. Right, you. Um, what trains are we going to want? Now, this is the livestock going out here, isn't it? Yeah, so, buy trains. And, of course, now we've got all the old steam trains. We, we've got everything. So, if we want to put a steam train, like a historic route or something, we can. It's kind of nice. So, I'm going to go... Now, I'm really tempted because this is a, this is a pretty long route. I wonder if we go for the class, um, is it 246? No, uh, the class 103s. Now it's got a top speed of 124, and it's got massive pulling power, but it costs 16 million, whereas the 185 is only 10. Uh, but I think, I think this is a case where we should use 103s, so that's what we're going to use. So, buy 103. And then we're going to stick, oh, let's find it, God, got lots and lots and lots and lots of carriages now. <laughs> God, look, millions of them, millions of them. I don't even know which one I want. What about these hoppers? Uh, no, it's like we want livestock with box cars. I, want to, I don't want to use these for grain sometimes. Um, that's a fakes box car, here we go. Where's the modern stuff? Oh, these are the Russian ones. Um, I think okay. This is the this is the normal one that carries thirteen. This is a Russian one. So this is the problem with a lot of these things that people make them a bit cheaty. So I'm trying to avoid. Um, so that's seventeen. That's seventeen. Seventeen. Whereas a, whereas a regular one is thirteen. Uh, yeah, yeah. So we'll go with the ordinary ones. We'll go with the ordinary ones, which are these ones. Good to make an HBI. So, yeah, just livestock. We want one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, let's go up to 315. Yeah, 315. How many trains do we want? This is the question. 
I'm thinking we want at least five, maybe six. Like, how long is this compared to the Apple Jack route? The Apple Jack route needs five, but that's from there to there. In actual fact, it needs four and a half, the Apple Jack line. That goes from there to there. This line goes from there to there. No, five. Five's enough. So one, two, three, four. Mind you, they're faster trains. I wonder if we could get away with four. So I put four on. Yeah, you know what? I'll put four on. And then if we need another one, we, we can always add another one later. So line 15. Yep, line 15. Boom, we've got those on. And then this is what, about the same length. Yeah, about the same length. But of course, we want these to go pretty quick, so we'll use the same ones again. And how are we going to do this? Yeah, let's put them. Let's put them on here. Okay, so let's get a depot, railway depot. Flip you around. Yeah, like that kind of thing. Hook you up again. Nothing fancy. Boom. And we want. Uh, Where's our 103s? 103s with... Uh, now, we're hauling grain now, aren't we? See, I would really like to use these hopper ones. Where are the hopper ones? I mean, look, these ones. This is the smaller one. That's capacity 13. That's capacity 19. And that costs a million. That costs 600,000. Where are the Where are the normal ones? The normal ones are, bum, 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 bum. where's the normal open wagons? Is it that one? No, that's, a... where's the regular ones? My God, can't find them now. There's, there's so much stuff in here now, it's hard to find what you're looking for. These are the state cars. Where are the, where's the regular? So that's a state car, that carries 13. I think the the regular open wagon is the same thing. Uh, that's a hopper, hopper, hopper. That's the oil tankers. Where's the regular open? Oh, here we go, open wagon. Yeah, it carries 13. So, you know what? I'm going to use these hoppers because I think they look really nice. Um, and that carries 13. And stone, grain, plastic. Oh no, what the hell am I talking about? We're taking food. I need a boxcar. You complete idiot. I was thinking, for some reason I was thinking grain. Why the hell doesn't my brain work properly? Right, where are we? Uh, goods wagon HBI. And yeah, uh, one. Oh, where's the. There it is. And that's too many. 315. So we want one, again, I'm thinking we want four of these. Yeah, let's do four. One, two, three, four. Set line, line 16, line 16, chiching. Oh my God, we're done. Huh. Whew. Okay, you know what? Let's have a ride on our lines. So let's come down here. Right, let's set it running. Right, you. Oh, no, I don't want to buy trains. I want to ride on the train. Here we go. Come on. Down there. Bit of a boring colour. I'm really, I'm really kind of tempted to change the colour on this train. Uh, the thing is, it changes the... Ca I really wish it didn't change the carriages. Yeah. Now yeah, we'll we'll live with it the way it is. All right, let's get on board with you. Now, obviously, I need to play around with the terrain on this line, but I'm going to leave it as it is for now. So, what speed are you doing, like right now? 13 miles an hour while it's coming out of the station. But hopefully, once it's all through this curve, let's. Oh, here we go. Oh, we're speeding up now. 
Oh, and we're off and running on our brand new, what was it, 103? Lovely detailing of the models on the top. So, we're coming around, past the oil, uh, past the oil well. See, I need to, I need to smooth the terrain out here and all kinds of stuff that needs to get done. What speed are we doing? 74? Still maintaining 74 up the hill. Should start to pick up a bit of speed now. Oh, aircraft have reached their lifetime. And up to 85 now, going over the bridge. Now we're going over the halo, or we would go over the halo if we weren't lagging. Oh, there we go. Crossing the mega halo. Sharing, uh, well not sharing the tracks, but running alongside the tracks of the oil trains. Look how much faster we are. Ho, 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 yeah. 99, 100. Yes, good trains doing over 100 miles an hour. Racing along. You've got to admit, the place really is starting to look quite good. I mean, I've still got a huge amount of work to do on the on the scenery. Like, like I mean, my, like I don't know, like 90% of the map I need to work on the scenery. But look, look at that station. It's very, very impressive. Right now, we're going over the TGV line. And into our curvy station. Oh, and look, one of the others is coming out in the opposite direction. Now, this is going to flip around and immediately go out the other direction. Let's have a little bit of actual first person and see what this looks like. So we switch onto the other line. So this is the uh, this is the bridge that takes us over the TGV on the way back. Oh, there's the TGV! Oh, perfect timing! TGV whizzing along underneath. Awesome source. Oh, heading for Lagville. Signal turns to green. That's what we like. Green signals all the way. Oh, there's another 103 coming along. Oh, isn't that beautiful? And then over the viaduct across the valley. Still signals green. What's that? Is that, is that the... Oh, that's the oil refinery again. Oh, and a bit more lag. Stop lagging, game, for heaven's sake. And... Then we've got to cross... Oh, we've got to cross the Mega Halo again. There's another train going by. Onto the oil train. Oh, and now we've got oil trains coming past. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, the series is back on track now. Loads of train action. I mean, all the sky candy is nice, and um, obviously we see, look at that. Look at the, the, the depot down on the right hand side. Crossing the mega halo. And... And a little bit of lag to round off. Passing the oil train that's pulling into its station. There's the third train. So all the trains are out on the track now, and I would say four trains is just about right. We might need a fifth. But they do need loading time as well, so yeah, I don't know, we'll see with four, we'll see how we do. And we zip along the last bit of the route, through the cutting. 
Oh, there's the depot that we came from. And we pull into the station. Now, do we have any goods to pick up? Do we have any livestock? Stop lagging. Damn you. Let's see, do we have any like I bet we don't. Oh my god, we do. We've got eight livestock to pick up. Hooray! And there was much rejoicing. So there we go. That's working. Right, let's go zip back to the other end of the line. Uh, which is here we go. To our curvy station. Oh, and we're just in time. We're just in time to get on train 223. Let's ride on board train 223. Now, this is the one. This is the one I'm really looking forward to because, my God, I think this is going to be a bit of a ride. Uh, I'm, I'm actually going to angle maybe down a little bit to try and reduce the lag. I want to keep watching the speed. So, it's not having a problem pulling the weight, that's for certain. Look at this in the background. I mean, seriously, if, if you've ever been kind of like outside a big city with a view of this, like, like in Jersey, um, if you're in Jer New Jersey looking at New York, this is kind of what it looks like. So we whiz down the hill, we're going to get up to max speed going down here. Come on, we want to get up to 124. We want to see the awesome uberness of the 103 in full flight. 99, 100. Oh, I think he's going to get limited by this bend here. Yeah. Oh, my, you know what? I should have checked the goods cars. I think the goods cars can do more than 100, though. I'll check that afterwards. If, well, if I remember, I'll check it afterwards. Now we're on to the Mega Halo. Oh, my God. We've got a clear route through the station. I bet that's not going to happen that often. Whiz through the station. Let's just hang it down. got our, our very weird flying junction like I said this is not a traditional flying junction but it's it, the problem is because I've got six tracks together but yeah it is what it is and then we pull into our final destination Are we carrying um, no we're not carrying any food yet it's not a surprise expect there to be any yet. All right, so you're going to pull in turn around. Do you want to get? Do you want to go first? Yeah, of course you do. Look at oh, look at Rogie. How freaking good does Rogie look up on the hill? Are you going to turn around, train? Or have you left us behind? Oh no, he did. Too. He, was, he was just turning around. I need to be more patient. So we are heading away from Rogie. Um, this is, is this Troy over here? Or is that Troy there and this is Sparksville? No, this, this must be Troy, mustn't it? I don't know. I think that's Troy. Oh, look at this! Look at the Mega Halo. And now we come down here under the bridge. Oh, stop lagging, game. You're spoiling it. Oh, and now we've got a red signal because there's a... Oh, look at that! <laughs> oh, highlight of my day. Can we get on? Can we go yet? Oh, we've got to wait for him to get down track a little bit. Oh, here we go. Here we go. A little bit lumpy and bumpy here. Probably smooth that out a bit. We're on riding on the Mega Halo. Passing. That's got to be Troy. Yeah, that's got to be Troy. Stop lagging, game. Damn you. Oh, green. So my timing of the signals is just about right. 
There's another one of the dual stocks. And then we've got to wait because this dual stocks is sitting in the station. This line is not going to be the most efficient line, but, ah, you know, it is what it is. I don't care. And I don't think you, well, I don't think most of you will care either. We've got an oil train going through. We need to wait for the halo train to go away. Come on, come on. Here we go. Look how busy it is. Trains everywhere. Oil trains, passenger trains, food trains. Oh, come on, lag. Come on, stop it. Behave. God, you know, if this game... If they could make the performance better on this game... Oh, my God. This would be, like... I think this would be my number one game of all time. In fact, I'm pretty absolutely damn sure it would be. Because look at it. If, if it's the only thing that holds this game back is the lag. I mean, the mods that are coming out now. Oh, there's there's the train yard, the rail yard. It properly should be called a marshalling yard or a shunting yard. Look! 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 look, look, look. <laughs> How freaking cool is that? Oh, oh God, I wish there were loads more trains in the in the yard now. Let me zip up the hill. We're still doing 90 up the hill. I'm impressed. Oh, come on, game, stop lagging. See, when it's not being laggy, it's beautiful. Now, what town is this? This has got to be... Uh, confused for it over there. That must be confused for it. Yeah, 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 it is. That's Ice Cream Town over there in the distance. And we complete our journey pulling into the station. Now, I wonder if there will be any food for us to pick up. Let's have a look. Yeah, hooray! There is a little bit of food. How much food did we get? We got two food! Well, at least the line works, so that's good news. Come on, get out. Go away. Right, do we have trains waiting or anything? We don't have trains waiting over here. Where's the next train? Where are you? We, m we may need another train. We may need another train. Stop being laggy, game. Where's the next train? Let me, turn my, let me turn my train icons on. Oh, here it comes. So, yeah, I think um, I think we could handle a fifth train on this line. And if we could handle a fifth train on that line, we could probably handle a fifth train on this line. But you know what? We can add. We can add later. I mean, capacity-wise, we're like massively over capacity at the moment so production production is coming up at the at the uh, at the at the Yorkie Pud factory so this must be where they grow the Yorkie Puds and then and then the Yorkie Puds are actually like cooked and whatever over there <laughs> yeah because you because you really grow Yorkie Puds they don't they don't look it up if you don't know um so yeah we're up to 36 I, think, I really am thinking we're going to need a fifth train. How much food have we got waiting? Uh, sorry, livestock six. It's not very much. Yeah, well. Alrighty. So, oh, hang on. I, what, I tell you what I didn't look at. I didn't look at, like, demand. Yeah, let's see what the, de uh, what the demand is at the food processing thing. Because it should be very, very high. Let's have a look. Uh, details. The demand for the products, 168. What? This should be like, I don't know, like 10,000 or something. Okay, we'll, we'll um, I guess we'll keep a, an eye on that in uh, in future episodes. Oh, man. You know what, guys? This has been fun. I've really enjoyed this. I really enjoyed riding around on the trains. We've got to do more of that. 
and uh, the beach craft and the jet foils and all the new buildings and stuff. I tell you what, you've got plenty to comment about, so I expect lots of comments on this video. I will catch you for the next one. I hope you enjoyed this. Peace out. <laughs>